Not everyone takes advantage of their unplugged opportunity. In 1996, when Oasis did their Unplugged, lead singer Liam Gallagher blew his chance to shine and handed the spotlight to his songwriting brother Noel. Even before we got to the day of the show, there was a concern, a concern, that, uh, <laughs> what's going on with Liam? Liam was in the paper a lot leading up to the Oasis Unplugged. He was portrayed as, you know, a bad boy. I think we'd, we'd rehearsed for two weeks before, and then Liam, I remember, turned up once or twice. I'd distinctly remember he came in in a natty little green shirt, green shorts, green shoes. It was really thought out. At some point during the song, Liam would kind of point to his throat like, I can't go on anymore. And Noel would start singing and Liam would walk off and the rehearsal would continue to go on. Next day, we go back, he shows up a little later, sings a little less. Third day rehearsal, shows up, he's wearing the same clothes, he hasn't shaved, sings three songs, leaves. We've been told he didn't want to rehearse too much because he wanted to save his voice. But you get to a point where it's like, what's up with this guy, is he going to show up? The day of the performance, he hadn't turned up and there was rumours that he'd been out drinking for a couple of days and nobody knew where he was. And about an hour before we were due to go on, he turned up absolutely Face. Good morning, what's that fly? I said, well, look, let's see if you can sing a couple of songs, and it was just dreadful. Oh, my God! We had the whole crew there. Everybody was standing by. So the decision was, let's go ahead and tape the show, and then we'll see what happens after that. As they said, ladies and gentlemen, Oasis. We just walked out, and he wasn't there, and he's just like, I'm not doing it. So they're like, thanks a lot. Um, Liam ain't gonna be with us tonight because he's got sore throat. We started to do the show, Oasis minus Liam. I remember hearing someone say, Liam's in the house. One of the camera guys pans up and there's Liam with some champagne. Son of a bitch. He was just drinking and just slow and clapping. Once he knows that the camera was on him, he sort of acknowledged the fact that, yes, I'm up here drinking beer in the balcony and not performing today. And then proceeded to heckle his brother and the rest of the band. Shut up. And I was like, well, f thanks. You know, the least you could do is, you know, is show a bit of support. I don't believe that there's something when the songwriter themselves sings it, maybe he's a little more connected to the song. There was almost this kind of feeling like Noel was enjoying that moment too, where he had this opportunity to sing his own lyrics. I think I've done a great job, to be honest with you. Afterwards, the director said, um, we just want to do the first song again. Hey guys, if you hang tight, we are going to get another song. It'll just be a couple of seconds. And of course, then Liam comes on and he wants to sing <laughs> after we played for an hour and a half or something. So we just told him to piss off. And he went home, sulking.